initial brief for Sandy Bay was to really create a family home that would transcend all those special moments in life. Our client came to us and said that she'd love her two boys to get married on the deck one day, which is a really beautiful thing to work with because you know, you're creating a home that needs to transcend all different eras. To the root of all our projects, I'm always looking at the existing architecture and my gut instinct for this place was, wow, this is an incredible 70s merchant home that seemed to have been robbed of all its 70-isms. Let's get this back to being 70s. But ultimately, I always want it to be fresh and contemporary and something new that has evolved. The moment you drive down this meandering driveway, there's this lovely mystery to the space. You get this sense of this house that's sort of tucked away in the woods. At the entry, we created this beautiful charred timber portal and this large overscaled pivot door. There's this lovely sense of arrival. When you walk in the door, you've got this beautiful corridor that is a lower ceiling and then it pushes you out into an expansive living room and you really feel the nature all around you. Then you get the beautiful bay view from that living room. Every time I walk in here, I think, wow, this house feels very quintessential Australian. These long view shafts through the space and then the gums surrounding and then the birds tweeting. What we wanted for the home was a lifetime here of memories and for the boys to grow up and to feel so comfortable. All the things that we chose to put in here were timeless, you know, they weren't precious finishes. All the furniture, all the fixtures felt really easy to live with. I think this was like a canvas that we would continue to layer for years and years to come. I would select finishes that were prevalent in the 70s, but also in a little bit more neutral kind of way. The terrazzo was quite big in the 70s. The stone walling, the use of brick detailing, copper, brass, just that more handmade feel. There's neutral spaces and there's some loud gestures throughout the space, but ultimately they all interweave and connect. And they become like a really lovely little story that always harks back to that family home. Our home has really become a central part of our family. We gather around our kitchen bench, around our outdoor table. We've had Christmas here the last few years. So it's become a real entertaining and family hub. It was really always about the view. For us, Fisher and Paykel in this kitchen seemed like a natural fit. What I love about their product is how minimal and recessive they become in the kitchen, acting like a little canvas in themselves, reflecting the beautiful view behind. For this project, Dave specified two of our new all-black built-in ovens, a 90 centimetre induction cooktop, 90 centimetre French door integrated refrigerator, and a double integrated dish drawer. Dave described the family aspect and how him and Josh like to entertain. From a functionality point of view, the two ovens were essential to the design. And by having the all-black ovens in our range, it just takes that little bit of stainless steel out that didn't really exist in this material palette. Dave's done a fantastic job of integrating the refrigerator, lifting it up, completely concealing the bottom grill, and run the doors slightly longer with an internal cupboard. I love the transition that we've created downstairs. So upstairs really has this connection to the old house, whereas downstairs is where the biggest changes happened. It's really a parent's retreat. So our bedroom is beautiful, the master suite is beautiful, and probably my favorite room of all, the gym. One of the greatest aspects of opening up downstairs was we excavated into the land and actually formed this large corridor, which in turn became a really open laundry. The view looking out the main bedroom is wonderful. Super private, but you engage with the lower terrace and all the large trees. It's a really beautiful place to wake up in the morning. Em and Josh place such importance on the outdoor space and the connection to the house. So it was great to see that outdoor kitchen and how beautifully it's designed. It's a big black monolithic structure with one of our DCS barbecues installed into it. Design is paramount to our clients' lives. 
It changes their lifestyle, the way they live, the way their boys grow up, all the family moments that would happen here. So it's been a wonderful process designing Sandy Bay with our clients, Em and Josh. I hope that one day we'll be here for the wedding on the deck. Can't be any more prouder of the friendships that we've forged.